What's up everybody, back with some War Robots. So today we're taking a look at the Kepri with Dread Scald. So we got the Kepri here with the Dread Scald. And this is a build I've, you know, thought would be interesting. I thought we might as well try it out. And to any of you Kepri fans out there, I apologize because I completely forgot this robot existed. No, I am not kidding. I was literally just scrolling through my inventory um, of robots and stuff. And I came across the Kepri and I'm like, oh yeah, I forgot about this thing. So, it's been a very long time since I've played this. Um, I don't know if this is going to work all, all too well just because that rust effect. And the Kepri's bond ability can heal. So, I don't know. We have the Kestrel Drone for a 9% death mark, 7% additional damage. The Ponchi Pilot, which you know one thing that I think is hilarious? So, we have the two names here. The Miski or whatever. I don't even know how to pronounce them. I don't even know. Um, but anyways, whatever the girl's name is, and Ponchi, right? I like how no one even bothers to say what the girl's name is. They just say, yeah, we got the Ponchi pilot. That's, like, they just don't even bother. It's kind of funny to me. Um, and then we have two nuclear amps and a balance unit. And obviously I don't have the standard paint shop. I mean, come on, what? Do you think I'm, like, a lunatic? Nah, we got this. I'm not even going to run my Liberty one. I don't have the uh, special Liberty one. But I do have the special for the whatever this paint shop is. And for the, um, and for anyone that's wondering about yesterday's video, and why it hasn't uploaded yet, it is taking forever, so there's going to be two videos coming out today, uh, yesterday's video and obviously today's video. Now, in that, in yesterday's video, I believe I said that the Ophion nerf and the Achokachi nerf never happened, and I was mistaken. Both of the nerfs for the Ophion and the Achokachi came. And we're going to be taking a look at those. You might get a little bit of gameplay from both of them today. But we're going to do an actual video on them. Uh, Ophion tomorrow. Achukachi Friday. So stay tuned for that. And then if we take a look at my Fafnir build. I've got Huzar and Wasp. I don't know. I wanted to try this build. See if it um, would work. Uh, we got the Corrupted Fafnir. And then the Paralysis Drone for Lockdown. And then just Balance Unit stuff like that and yeah we're gonna hop into some games and see if the kepri even is still good uh the kepri got a few nerfs i remember back in its prime time it was like it, it was everything it was like the all-rounder like it was a tank a support speed beast it was just a lot so um for those of you who don't remember what the kepri does you can link on people like that so you can heal them up and I believe it keeps the damage, and I think my punch is probably like it. Freeze, lock down, question. Basically like a anti-control. 217,000 is isn't that bad. Um, yeah. oh. And the... Oh, oh my god, my... What? Up 
I can do something. Alright, perfect. be honest, Kepri did okay. Uh, not really the best. Definitely not what it was in his prime time, but we'll do another game, see what happens. 1.6 million damage, two assist, or one assist, three kills, three beacons, third place. Oh, we were actually going up against a, uh, duel. Actually, I can't speak today, guys. Like, I said duel, not duo. Anywho. Hop into another game here. Actually, let's collect whatever this is first. Because I feel like it. Uh, oh, Ooh. Oh, I just need to kill two more people and I'll get that thing. 
Yeah, and then wait. Uh, can someone... Wait. Somebody tell me what that does, because I'm not fully understanding. Cause it says win and be top on your team. Does that mean, like, top for everything? Like, damage, healing, all that stuff? Or is it just you have to be the number one player and win? Like, I'm not fully understanding it. Either I'm just stupid or... It's, I'm, <laughs> anyways, let's drop the uh, Kepri. Honestly, I still love the design of the Kepri. They did, Pixonic, I will admit, did a great job of the design. Even when it's... I hate doing the players why, players why, players why. That's why. That's why I hate doing the Bro, that is. Nah, you're dead. You are dead. 
He's he's already got a root on him. Unbelievable, that's really bro. Honestly, I would I would consider the theory overpowered. I honestly would. The, the turrets for sure would be good. There's no question. The turrets 100. Also, that just proves how broken the Kiri is. I I know people don't say it is, but no, it it's it's broken. I'm I'm saying it right now. It is broken. Anyways, 2.7 million damage, zero assists, two kills, three beacons, third place. Is this the Kiri guy? Yes, it was. Glory. This guy had this. This guy had the whole like, whole thing here. I wonder what was that one guy with the um. I think he had ultimate coronas on his Ophion. Yeah. Two ultimate coronas and then ultimate punisher T. He's also got two ultimate igniters on a Lancelot. Interesting. And he's got ultimate organs. I mean, why wouldn't he? I wouldn't be surprised. He's got more ultimate organs. Honestly, I wouldn't be surprised. He's got the ultimate Ares. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I'm not surprised if this guy gets the ultimate Alming. Honestly, not surprised. Alright, so. That is the uh, Kepri for you. With the Scald. Overall, not that bad. Um, definitely not the best. I bet you if there was no Rust effect in the game, this thing would probably do a lot better. Because when you... Because this thing heals, right? Obviously, the Rust just takes that healing away, so... Definitely used to be better. A um, little sad that it's not, you know, the strongest thing in there, but... Because I did enjoy running the Capri. I still do. And yeah, uh, stay tuned for either a separate video with the Capri uh, Magnetar or in my li next live stream. Also, stay tuned for the Ophion Acho videos. And potentially a Fafnir video on Monday. There might be one on Monday. But yeah, so... Tell me what you guys think about this build down in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed, please like and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it and it would help us out. And yeah, with that being said, have a fantastic day. And I will see you in the next one. Adios.